Oh, hi. Um, I've been having a little problems with this iPod right here. And if anyone out there on YouTube can help me out, um, please do so. And my problem is that when I, I do have internet connection on that, yes, you see, there's Wi-Fi. And it's running 3.0. And what I don't like about the 3.0 is, um, on the settings tab, there was hold on, let it load up. I don't know why mine takes too long to load up. Um, right there. Um, uh, it's on the settings. And there used to be underneath. It said, um, am I holding this upside down? Oops. It's uh, like this. Okay. There used to be something called push. It is not there anymore. There used to be something called on the iPhone. I'm not if the iPhone has the same problem. Um, the airplane mode. I don't know if the iPhone has the same problem. Um, and it is 3.0. As you can see right there, spotlight. And I do have internet connection, and right there, just for you guys, um, it is right there, and I will go on to Google. And why I'm telling you guys this is just, I want to know if others have the same problem. Okay, now, when I go on to YouTube, right there. YouTube there I, I got an error message saying cannot connect to YouTube so and once again it's on a 3.0 firmware and uh, it has all those landscaping and all that like the others and I just need some help on my YouTube thing that I'm having a problem with and just send me a personal message if you guys know what's wrong with my iPod. And I'm going to post this video to some expert um, iPhone users, uh, iPod Touch users, so they can help me out. Um, some hackers out there. I, I am um, going to jailbreak my iPod Touch firmware. And I'm just looking forward to get the 3.0 second beta. And it's hard to get it. Um, I just don't know how to. I know I have some links to download it, but I don't know how to extract all of them. I have WinRAR. I have all parts of it, all three parts, but I don't know how to get them in one piece. Okay. So I like I. It's right here. I put to it. 3.0 firmware 3.0 to part 1, part 2, part 3. They're in three separate WinRAR folders, and I want to know how to get them to be one firmware, just one Aqua Touch firmware. So if there's anybody out there that can help me out with that, um, I'd be more than glad. Okay, um, let's see. Thanks for watching. Um, visit my channel, look at some videos, and see you guys next